And new tonight at 9, students and friends are gathering to remember the Port Allen family who died in a plane crash in Colorado last Sunday. Fox 44's Jacqueline Kissick was at the balloon release tonight for the family. Jacqueline, this has to be tough on that community. To Varius, the Kirby's death was sudden and it was tough. The people I talked to tonight say they have a lot of grief after this tragedy, but tonight was about moving forward. <laughs> a tragedy bringing friends, family, faculty, and students together. At first, I uh, wasn't okay. Three members of the Port Allen community, the Kirby family, Ian, 17, his sister Amanda, 13, and their loving mother Sandra all died in a plane crash in Colorado on July 17th. It's unfortunate that we've gotten to know them so well under such tragic circumstances. Going into his senior year, Ian, a trumpet player for the Poor Allen Band of Blue, was the life of the party for the Pelicans. Talented, had a bright future, um, and, and it sucks to lose him. Haley Johnson knew Amanda and Ian since preschool. She remembers Amanda playing clarinet and watching her brother from the sidelines at games, hoping to be like him one day. I knew Amanda way better, but I knew Ian too. Like he was a very good band player. He was always excited. The band ending their summer camp Friday with a finale performance. Marching outside to hold a balloon release. They say it's not to mourn, but to celebrate the life of the Kirby family. They were really good people. Always people to depend on. Band director Baron Hunter says they will continue to push forward for Ian. And I told them hashtag crank for Ian. Basically saying that we have to, we got to push forward and do it for him. A GoFundMe page has been set up to raise money for a memorial service and to make a donation. We'll have that link on our website at BRProud.com. Jacqueline Kissick, Fox 44 News. All right, sad story. Thanks, Jacqueline. In developing news tonight, a new